today let us learn how to use conditional operator that is if and three other variables that is index first and last so this is the code we wrote for our previous day video tutorial link to which is present on your computer screen right now I'll compile this code and show you the output on your computer screen it's just a bunch of company names that is a list of company names so we have a variable called index which holds the number of iterations being completed in a loop so we'll print that out we need to print the i and not the index so as you could guess it will print from zero and then increment to fix this we can simply add plus one to it and it would be nicely printed from one two and so on for our users we also have another variable called last so this is important because by using this variable value we, we can know the last iteration in any loop and perform some actions here i'll simply show you by displaying um, some string hey i'll use ng if so this is how we use conditional operator in ionic ng if and then lst the variable which holds the value of last so when this is true which means when the iteration is at the end it would be printed that is beside ibm we have another variable called first so in this case it will be printed besides the first iteration value that is microsoft so this is it i am doing a separate video tutorial for this because this is important this may look very small but mind you this would be very handy in future so please keep this in mind the usage of if that is ng if conditional operator and the uh, use of these three variables that is index first and last so ng if takes boolean values if the value is true in that case it would add the node to the dom if the value is false then it won't add the node it is attached to to the dom thanks for watching please share this video with your friends on facebook google plus linkedin twitter etc and stay subscribed to technotip.com and to our youtube channel and please do not forget to like this video on youtube thank you